welcome back to my channel. Uh, not to be dramatic, but this is the fourth or fifth video or more. Let me let me count real quick. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is the sixth video that I have filmed today, and I still have, I believe, one more to go, and then I'm going to try and edit them. I have to film a couple clips for some post reviews uh, outside in the sun, weather permitting, but today we have a Star Or unboxing. So Star Or came out with a couple paintings for Halloween and I am insane and I was like, you know what, let me bite off more than I can chew. So I did. So I got Funky Skull. It is a 35 by 45, I believe. That is the um, entire canvas piece. I think this is just a 30 by 40 drill area. We will check that. Yeah, this is a 30 by 40 drill area. It's a 30 by 45 canvas piece. Yeah, drill area, 30 by 40. And drill, no, drill area, 30 by 40 canvas size, 34 by 45. So what do we get in a Star Wars diamond painting kit, toolkit? We are gonna get the Star Wars tweezers and these are the dulled edge tweezers so you don't have to worry about um, accidentally stabbing your eye out. Focus, 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 focus. So that is Star War and did I, didn't I just tell you to focus? Come on, work with me here. Star War and Dull Edge. And we also got a white boat with a funnel. We have the Star War baggies, which I absolutely love. We've got a straightener, a four placer, a seven placer, one blue heart-shaped pad of wax, a squishy and a plastic tipped pen, and of course we're gonna get her wonderful release papers. These are my favorite release papers. I typically use the ones from Amazon because they are a lot cheaper, but they're also a lot cheaper, you know. So <laughs> that is what is in a Star or toolkit. I'm gonna go ahead and Put this away, slip it back in its baggie if it will let me. And we will set that off to the side. Here is our star, our, my pirate. Here's our star or how to diamond paint. And here is the inventory sheet. Looks like we have 25 colors, hopefully, maybe, possibly. I might try and get this done before this is over, this being Halloween. The day I'm filming this is Thursday, the 29th. Oof, yeah, mm -mm. No, no, I don't think I'm gonna get it done in time. But it is beautiful nonetheless. I'm not really sure why Star Wars uh, released the Halloween things like two or three weeks before Halloween, but Especially with the shipping time, it just doesn't really make much sense. But this is the soft backed canvas and it has these scalloped edges to prevent fraying. Oh, something fell. That was the toolkit. Are we sticky? Quite sticky. Let's take a look at the drill field. Actually, let's zoom in. Oh, more things are falling. Zoom in, take a look at the drill field. It is super clear. Flip this over. Let's take a look at these drills. Okay, let's start with, well, so this must be number one. 25, 24, 23, 22, 21. Okay, so I am incorrect. 20, okay. So, this is Zoom you in and try and get this to focus. Here is a beautiful uh, garnet crimson color here. Why is it not, I'm not pleased with the angle I'm getting. So I'm gonna change the angle to try and give you the best lighting possible so we can see these crystals. There we go, that's better. So here is our crimson color. This is a peachy. Here is pink. 
another pink, another darker pink. This looks like silver. Here is a teal, a beautiful blue. It's a soft pink, another, this is like a purpley pink. Here is another purple, a darker purple, a darker purple, <laughs> and here is some blue. Here is pink and a more vibrant pink. This is a soft silver. This is another silver. I'm not really sure what the difference is. 17 and 18. Yeah, they're all, the silvers I'm finding are different. Six, nine, oh, four, eight, let's see, 82. Yeah, they're different. Here's another silver and another silver. It must be just different. Oh, you can't even see, I'm sorry. So they're all silver, but it's different degrees of uh, depth, I guess. Then we will go into the next one. Here is another silver and this is like a, this has more uh, yellow to it, I would say. Hey, cut it out. This one has a little bit more yellow in the silver and this one is a light gold and here is 310, I think. Well, they're black drills. And then here is, ooh, I love this purple. And here is a pink. So. This is a, another Crystal Canvas by Star Or. I loved my uh, Glamorous Sky by Star Or. That was super awesome. I enjoyed every second of working on that one. I hope to get to this one soon. Um, that's so weird that there's so many silvers. I don't really see where they would go. I mean, in between the ribs here and around the guitar and in the guitar there and I guess everywhere. Um, I don't know. We'll see. This is 25 colors. I believe the last one had... Actually, let me go check. It's on my wall. Hold on. Okay, I just checked and it has 26 colors. So this one has one more color than the other one. So I'm excited. Very excited. No, one less. Yeah, this is 25, that one's 26. What am I saying? Anyways, I'm really excited to hop into this one. I don't know when I'll do it. Will I save it for next Halloween? Will I do it in November? I'm not really sure, but I can't wait to do it regardless. I really enjoyed the crystal canvas from the uh, Star or the Glamorous Sky. Um, at this time, I've only done crystal canvases from two companies, and I have had pretty good success with both of them. Um, significantly more so with Star War. There was some trash in the other one, but trash is normal, so it's not really that big of a deal. But I definitely had more success with the Star War Crystal Canvas than the other one I did. So I'm excited to get into this one. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please give me a thumbs up. And if you liked it and would like to see more from me, please hit subscribe. I would be so happy to have you. Alright guys, I hope that you are being safe, washing your hands, and taking care of yourselves. Bye guys.